Now, this can be a quick video of how to quote unquote fix the black levels in the Quest 2. Now, people have been complaining that, you know, the Quest 2's, you know, black levels are not as great as the Quest 1. Now, that's obviously true because of the screen. But you can mitigate this and actually tweak it so it's more to your liking. If you already have your Quest side loaded, this is going to be quick and easy. But first things first, let's assume that you're starting from the bare bones Quest 2 with no side loading. And in order to side load, you have to turn on developer mode first. Now, to do that, you have to go to this website and essentially sign up as a developer. Now, you can type in any name you want, just go through the process, and essentially, once you get the email confirming that you're a developer, then you're good to go. Now, open up the Quest app on your phone and go to Settings. Now, under Settings, you should see your Quest 2. Now, click on that, and more options will pop up. And the next thing you click on is More Settings. Now, in this new menu, click Developer Mode, and make sure that Developer Mode is ticked on. Next, restart your headset. Next thing you want to do on your PC is look up SideQuest and download the app for your PC. And once that's all installed and ready to go, open up the app. Now you notice on the top it says not detected. That means your headset is not detected yet. Now connect your Quest 2 to the PC with a USB cable. Now put on your headset and a notification like this will pop up. Now make sure to check the box next to always lock from this computer and click OK. Now once this is done, remove the headset and make sure that on the top left of the SideQuest app now shows a green dot and shows your Quest 2 connected. Congratulations, now you have the ability to sideload apps. But if you already could do that, the next thing you should do is download the Settings app. Now, you could easily find it here on SideQuest by going up to the search bar, looking up Settings, scrolling down, and clicking on Android System Settings Launcher. After this, simply install a headset. Alternatively, you could also download it off the internet. Now, you may think that this APK is sus. In fact, it's just the Settings menu on a normal Android phone, but just being put back into your Quest 2. Go back to the SideQuest app on your PC, Click on this little icon on the top, it says Install APK. Now browse through your computer to find where you put the APK when you download it, and just click Open. Once the green bar on the bottom says All Tasks Complete, now put your headset back on and navigate through the menus to the TV menu. Now under Channels, you'll find this brand new widget, and it's called Settings. Click on that. And if you're familiar with Android, this will look very familiar. So just scroll on down till you see Display, click on that, and now you have the Brightness level. Once again, click on the brightness level, move the slider to your liking, and there you go. Now notice this is just a pretty much quote unquote quick fix. And this is not going to affect the contrast in any way. It's just going to lessen the impact of the bright screen. And for you virtual desktop users, you may not know, but there's also features like this already baked into virtual desktop. Under the settings menu, there's a brightness level. And under the streaming settings, you can change gamma level. So there you go. Again, this is just a quick fix. Maybe we'll eventually get an official Oculus supported thing, but for now, at launch, this is the best and easiest way to improve the black levels on your Quest 2. Well, that's the video. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and hopefully this was helpful to you. See you guys later.